In this video, we'll show you how to use DesignerLogic's Web Clipper to clip products and items from websites and save them to your favorites board in DesignerLogic. The favorites board is where you can keep items for future use on projects. So first you want to navigate to a web page that has the item on it that you want to clip. Open up DesignerLogic's uh, Web Clipper. Choose favorites from the selection at the top. And then you want to add um, all this data to um, the clipper um, just like a normal product. You just right click on an image and you can add it as a main image. You can right click on smaller images and add them as additional images from the designer logic menu by right clicking and then scrolling down. And we'll add a few images here really quick. And this last one right here. Okay, now you can see all these images are in the clipper. And then we want to add um, the rest of the data. So we're going to minimize the clipper so we can see everything on the website a little bit easier. And we go down uh, after highlighting and right clicking and we choose where um, that data goes into. In this case, this is retail price. And we'll put this information right here in the notes. Down below, we'll go put some dimensions in this item. And then these details and specs of the item, we're going to actually right click and copy and paste them so that we preserve the formatting. So back here, if we go to the web clipper, we go to specs right here, click into the specs box, and we want to just right click and hit paste. And you can see the formatting stays. Now up here, um, back at the top of the clipper, we have the items pictures. We can add tags for this item. And you can even add tags for projects, like that might go on this project, this project, and this project in the future, and that project. So we click on that, and you can see the product information carried over, the financials carried over. Let's say you get a 20% discount. It calculates the cost. Normally, you mark it at 50%. If you click on that, you'll see the client price is right here. You can say it is taxable, and we'll go to the suppliers, restoration hardware. And then down here, um, you can see all the rest of this information was saved, including the notes that we right clicked on, and we just click Add to Designer Logic. And that adds the item to your favorites. If we go back to the Designer Logic tab in Chrome, we will refresh the, the page. And if we scroll down, usually it puts it at the bottom of the list here. You can see this lamp right here with all this information in here. And if we click on the details link, you can actually even see all the additional um, images that we saved, all the spec information. And this can then be added to um, a project at any time in Design Logic by just essentially checking it off and saying, I want to copy that item to a project. And you can put it in a project anywhere you want. Click update, and what that will do is copy all this information, including the images, the specs, pricing, and everything, and put it on the project that you selected.